And now, please welcome to the Baloo Corner from Armenia, Jay Shigoyan! Jegis Yagoyan then, Peter did that perfectly, didn't he? Really did. Great MC, one of the best, I believe, in the game. So he trains with the Simpson Jim, Ryan Simpson. If you're not familiar with Ryan Simpson, then you're not a massive fan of Muay Thai, are you? Great fighter. Indeed, a classic when he fought Raman Decker and he threw a left hook at the same time and down they both went. Simpson got off the floor. God bless him. God bless the soul of Raman Decker. What a great fight he was. Anyway, sorry I reminisce. Start drifting, you know, ladies and gentlemen, at my age. But nevertheless, 39 fights, 29 wins, 8 losses, 2 draws, and 8 KOs. The Armenian Lion, another Armenian, makes his way to the ring here. On Infusion Line. from Cape Verde, Luis Tavares! Now, ladies and gentlemen, Luis Tavares makes his way to the ring, and his trainer, well, he's, he's bananas. But a very good trainer indeed, but he's very animated. And very good coach indeed, Pastoric. And his name, his, his, uh, sorry, his first name escapes me. But Tavares is a very good fighter indeed. And if you want to see anything of Tavares, go onto YouTube and have a look at Infusion's, uh, Infusion's channel. And you can see the day we met Wim Hof, the Iceman, the very famous holder of 26 world records, the Iceman himself. And we all went through his program. And let me tell you, that was an incredible experience. Have a look at that in two parts to see and also coming up later on will be Mohamed Mocha Kamal Mohamed the real fighter Kamal against Chang Kwek from Thailand Mohamed very good friend with Wim Hof anyway so there you go their name dropping you know the trainer may look like Gimli off Lord of the Rings but he knows what he's doing he's trained some very good fighters namely and a man you can see in the background there, Mustafa Dede. Mustafa Dede, very famous, very good fighter, also trained. Marat Direxi, but Mustafa Dede was very famous, an intricate part of Super League. Pioneer kickboxing shows from yesteryear. Just your screens, ladies and gentlemen. It's not Brian Blessed. It's the corner. It's past it. And so, ladies and gentlemen, introducing to you, firstly, fighting out of the blue corner. He brings a record of 39 fights with 29 wins. Eight of those wins coming inside the scheduled distance with eight losses and two draws. He's an ISKA IRO world champion from Armenia. Is he Yegis, the Armenian lion, Yegoya? Listen, this kid won't lie down for no one. He'll be as hard as they come, really. And across the ring, fighting out of the red corner. He brings a record of 52 fights with 46 wins. 18 of those wins coming by way of knockout with six defeats. He's an IKAWFL world champion from Cape Verde, where he is known as the infamous Luis Tuvade. And this bout is brought to you and proudly sponsored by SuperPoSamui.com. This Air Fusion Rules bout will take place in the minus 95 kilogram division. 
and will be contested over three three-minute rounds. In the event of a draw, there will be a fourth deciding round. So there you go then. Luis Tavares yeah, and Yegis. There's no love lost between you, just gonna say, and you can tell. No love lost at all. Tavares, his first fight for us here on Infusion. And there's a crack at Big Mo Bakari, who he's beaten before. So we'll see Yegish, never seen him fight in the black and red. And with Savares in the black, silver and white. Catches kicks really well, Tavares. When you kick him to the body, he catches legs and sweeps very well. More like a Muay Thai fighter in that sense. Yegis looking for bombs here. It's a nice overhand right that was from Yegis. Again, that landed good knee from Tavares. He's got to watch, he's got to respect Yegis though and keep his hands up. Hard leg kick that was. Both trying that. Not really much. Get, be able to get much dig in that. Can't get his shoulder over or turn his fist over properly on that shot. Tavares. He's trying that right hand counter. Yeah, I told you, so that's what he does very well. Didn't get to go underneath on that, but he does that a lot. That's a nice shot to the body. And one to the head from Tavares. Here. So he throws that right hand counter, but he comes back with the left hook, might land it. A bit low from Tavares. She resumes. Swinging left. Looks all those threatening though, does he? Yegis coming forward. Sharper speed comes from Tavares. Big boxing fan, massive Lomachenko addict as I am. Anyone that likes boxing would be. Yes. Slow, isn't he? Getting that leg kit off Yegis, just having a free shot there, just kind of sink a big heavy one in. The speed of Tavares is the key in this. Good movement. Risky risk taker though as well, isn't he? he? Likes that. Nice jab up through the middle. Good right hand the left up. We've got ends around. Give that to Varis. Yeah, as you can see, Ryan Simpson. Cut short his career by uh, unfortunately catching pneumonia. Caused a lot of damage to his lungs. He's still recovering from that, to be honest. There's some of the acts sweet. Sort of a corkscrew left up. Got, there's the overhand right that I said that. Can't really get much of anything on that. But Yegis was trying his own left bombs. You see how he laboured that kick a little bit. Just getting caught. Tavares, as I said, is good at catching kicks. Well, the battle plans will be laid out. There's both smart corners. Stays away. Go. Round two, Round then. Two. Nice. Caught shoot. Jab from Negish. Yes. 
Where is in danger, I believe, Tavares on the ropes. Backs himself up, was in great shape for this as well, but he'll back himself on the ropes a little bit. That's a big right hand, that was. There you go. So sharp, but left up behind it would be good. Yeah, get coming forward. It's the speed, isn't it, of Tavares? It's causing problems. That was nice. Spins. Yegis yeah, again, he's finding space for that left hook. Switching southpaw, going through that. Through the guard. Heavy left kick from Tavares. Looks like he's enjoying himself in there, starting to find angles and range. There's the right hand bounces off the head. Yegis, good left knee. Nice sneak left hand. Absolutely fuming in the corner, Ryan Simpson screaming. Yegis to use the right knee. And Tavares does keep his head a little bit low at times. Long left up round the corner. Does keep his arms a little bit low. Tavares at times shows good confidence. Yagi scoring with his own little bits here. Scoring now, Yegis, getting his own rhythm going. That was a sweet shot. See how the left up behind it would be so, so much better. Good timing, that is. Touch him with the jab now. Good left hand down the middle. There's that right hand again. That really hurt Yegis, that one. His legs seem to stiffen. He's looking to counter now, isn't he? And he's enjoying himself in there, Tavares. But as I said, Armenians are tough. And confidence, bold and arrogance here for uh, Tavares. And now Tavares, corner man winding up the Armenians. Can't see that off camera at the minute. So you can see them gaining confidence here, trying sneak shots, and there was so that was so nice. Just pulling him back from the jab and then throwing the right hand. But if he come back with the left hook, he would have uh, really been in trouble, I believe. Yes. Well, there's a man that's just signed for infusion. Mohamed Moja Kamal. And it's no introduction to kickboxers the world over. Seconds away. Round three. Round three. Overhand right, left hook for him. Tavares. Yegish coming forward to purpose. Great hand speed, hasn't he, Tavares? I'd just like to see more. Yeah, he needs to put the pressure on. So I'll let his bombs off, kick his way in. Seen that before in all my years. I think Yegis has hurt his arm. He's holding that a lot. I've never seen anyone sit down on anyone before. I mean, and I've seen wrestling from when Big Daddy was on TV. So. Took the point away. 
think. He pushed him. He had to think about that, didn't he? Yeah. He had to look at that, didn't he, Tavares? So. I did say there's no love loss, didn't I? So. Yeah, it's tough as all the Armenians are. <laughs> Left kick countered by underneath to the right leg. Again. Down he goes. Slips. Better. I catch his style, hasn't he? An enjoyable style, uh, Tavares, but you know, Yegish really having a go. Coming forward, sneak, left hook, ambitious swings. Swapping jabs now. That's such sweet moves. And that comes from watching boxing, you know. All oh, this comes from boxing. That, doesn't, that comes from uh, uh, End of the Dragon Part 3. Don't know where that comes from. High kicks. Yagish. Rock hard, tough. But he has got a. Close something here. This may go an extra round. We never know. We'll see. Jumping near attempt. Well, should have gone, but there was some time stop, wasn't there, for that? It's not an ass squeeze, but nevertheless, we know what's going on. Counters underneath. Nice to walk in with the knee. Yegi shows his hands up with the point taken away. You never know what the judges are seeing, you know. It's become an enigma to me. Time. Long knee. Combinations. That's very nice. Slips the jab, throws her out, got left up. That comes from watching boxing and practicing hours in the gym. It's very nice, that. Almost puts too much into it, though, doesn't he? Just brings his feet in with it too much, you know? But it's all things to work on. Listen, everyone can improve. So the judges have deliberated. And our MC, the man in the know, Peter Lowe, taking the gloves off from... Lewis Tavares, good fight. Our MC, uh, off camera at the minute, our MC, Mr. Peter Lowe, looks totally bewildered by Mr. Pasternik in the corner of Lewis Tavares, but he's a very good coach. He looks like um, John Goodman in uh, Tan Cloverfield Lane. <laughs> I don't want to myself, haven't I, before the decision's made, but there's a good fight, Yagish. Step on the gas earlier, and uh, but is the movement of Savaris and the sharpness and the speed that was causing the problems? But listen, we don't know, do we? Let's see Ladies who, and who a big you round like. Of applause for both men, please. And who the judges pick? And after those three completed rounds of action, your ringside judges have reached a unanimous decision. All in favour of your winner, fighting out of the 
Red there corner. You go. It's a Louis. Nice moves. Sharp. Yeah, he should be back, you know. Body. He'll be back in a, back to the drawing board and back to a good team. Simpsons, they know they're about. Yegis, the Armenian Lion. Yegis. Now he gets the challenge. Luis gets the challenge. Big Mo Bakari. So we'll see. That is not an easy fight for either boxer.